Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the glorious Phoenix Delta. Uh, here are some of the parts that I've printed to uh, serve as my new electronics case. So if you didn't watch the previous part, that's okay. The gist is I'm not too happy with the way that everything here is mounted. I think that it's a little floppy. And also it takes up more space than I would like since I have some other plans that are going to require most of this space for electronics. So the first thing here is this Raspberry Pi mount. It's actually like a, I think I just got it off a Thingiverse, a Raspberry Pi case that I just made this base for. Uh, and that way, this can go stick right on the extrusions here on the inside of the frame, and it's gonna be nice and out of the way. Um, one little issue here is getting the, focus, there we go, getting the uh, SD card in the Raspberry Pi, huge pain. I had to use tweezers to actually get it in. I wouldn't call this a wonderful design, but it's definitely functional and you're not gonna see it or anything once it's in place, so I think it's fine. Uh, this here I got from printables and it's just a little uh, fan mount that's gonna go on the Raspberry Pi. So there's spots for four, I think they're M3 nuts. And then this whole thing just goes right on top of the Pi and holds a cooling fan just to keep the temperatures down. Um, <laughs> the previous print here was using black filament and I didn't purge it very well apparently. Oh well. I talked to people in the Discord though and it seems like the general consensus is you don't really need active cooling for the Pi, so I might not be using that piece at all. We'll see. For the main board, it is virtually the exact same thing. Again, it just slots in these holes and the board mounts to this. And exactly the same deal here with this guy that's just going to go on like this for these three holes and it's just going to hold a cooling fan right above the stepper drivers. I think for the board itself it's probably worth it to add a fan, but I probably won't do it for the Raspberry Pi. Uh, these pieces all have to still be mounted and I have to take off the old stuff, but I just wanted to show off what the pieces are and sort of what I plan to do with everything before I actually do it. Alright, uh, thank you for your time and I'll see you in the next one.